the anomaly in this presentation in my book makes it to the list of top 10 weirdest anomalies I've discovered on Mars thus far. The site's located in a region called Sidonia Mense, just north of Marth Vallis. This is in the northern mid-latitudes of Mars. The context camera of the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter took this photograph on the 6th of July 2008 and they call it terrain north of Marth Vallis. We're looking at a scale of 5.73 meters per pixel. So not the usual high-res photographs that I've been showing you most of the time, which are JP2s at 25 centimeters per pixel. So this is a lower-res photograph, but the anomaly is so huge, you can't miss it. So let's have a look at the location. So the anomaly is located there, folks. And this is Marth Vallis in this region. And then we have Sidonia Mense over here. So it's between the two areas and the site is right there. And I've checked there is no high resolution or high-rise photograph of that site. It's at roughly 29 degrees, 15 minutes north, 19 degrees, 16 minutes west. I cropped this image from the TIFF file, which I downloaded off the site. This is actual size. So you can see from the scale indicator, this is definitely a lower resolution photograph to what we normally used to so I don't even have to highlight it folks you can see it right there it sticks out like a sore finger and it's approximately 300 meters in diameter this thing is absolutely huge what I find fascinating about it is it's right there in the center of that circular depression. There are smaller circular depressions in this photograph, some of them with small little dune fields, but nothing like this. Check out the symmetry and geometry of this anomaly, guys. What do we make of it? What produces something like that in nature? Was it a huge spherical ball that uh, crashed there? But how come it didn't break up? Or was this area muddy and this thing fell there and caused that circular depression? Or is it something that's been uh, made, manufactured in the center of that circular depression. So for some context let me take you up to that site to give an idea where it's located. So we have Sardinia Mense, Marth Vallis and the site is right there folks. If you switch on the CTX layer we'll be able to make it out a little better and zoom in there this takes a moment to load you can see there's lots of these smaller circular depressions and there is that weird anomaly I look forward to reading your comments, your analysis and opinion as to what this huge dome-shaped anomaly could be and what process, if it is natural, produces something like that in the center of a circular depression like a crater. It's a very strange one. 
Anyways, take care everyone. I'll see you in the next one soon. Bye for now.